The 2024 Olympic Games is just a couple of days away and with it comes all the prestige and challenges that could possibly turn many ordinary people into superheroes. Just ask the likes of Michael Phelps and Usain Bolt and you can quickly see why the Olympics is so important. For Simone Biles, the journey has been a little more complicated and after she actually withdrew from the previous Olympics in Tokyo, Simone Biles already stunned the world just a few years earlier in Rio by taking home four gold medals. However, her hiatus and often unpredictable behavior meant no one knew if she would be gunning for gold in Paris. She was having achieved incredible success at her debut Olympics in 2016. The pressure for Simone Biles to continue being one of the greatest gymnasts was certainly at a high. She would walk away from the Rio Olympic Games with four gold medals and another silver medal, which was kind of unexpected given that she was barely 19 back in 2016. However, the 2020 season was a little more complex and posed plenty of challenges to the young Simone Biles. She would not only have to endure some personal issues, but the pressure from fans would play an insane role in what would happen. Whilst the star of this young lady was shining before the 2020 Olympics, and she looked incredible in many of the warm-up competitions, things were never too easy on a personal level. With her now being compared to the likes of Phelps, the pressure was bound to get to the then only 25-year-old. Nevertheless, Biles did push through and thanks to this resilience, she would easily qualify for the Tokyo Summer Olympic Games, which would thrust her into the spotlight. However, Biles would only compete in the team competition and the balance beam, both disciplines in which she would come away with a silver or bronze medal respectively. But with the floor being her strong suit, many expected her to walk away with another gold medal at the Games, but this wasn't to be. Due to many personal issues, Simone Biles took a step back and she chose to focus more on personal life, which had also gained some popularity. You see, such a quick rise to the top made her a great option to be an ambassador, and her schedule was quickly filled up with some commercial priorities that needed attending. She had also openly admitted to prioritizing mental health over success, which greatly contributed to her decision to step away from the sport. This was met with a ton of criticism from certain fans. As was expected, many international news outlets and also some frustrated fans quickly took to social media platforms, where they would focus on criticizing the decision from Biles to take a break from the sport. In fact, this would end up in a situation where some commentators called her a quitter due to not having good enough form. But perhaps the most frustrating part of this for fans would be the fact that she hogged a position on the US Olympic team, which many fans believe kept another rising star from competing. According to some of the disgruntled fans, she should have decided not to go to the Olympics before she even went. In fact, it was Russian state-owned media that would come down and bows the hardest with racist and sexist comments aimed at completely destroying the legacy of Simone Biles. In fact, once it was revealed that she had been using ADHD medication, many fans of the sport also accused her of cheating through her use of various drugs. But Biles endured this onslaught and many other fellow gymnasts, some of whom would be her biggest competitors, actually came to her defense. You see, one thing many people don't understand about competing at such an incredibly high level is the fact that it takes a lot out of someone to actually continue performing at such a high level and intensity. After citing the twisties as her main reason, fellow gymnasts attest to also suffering from this condition. Now, this condition is widely seen as a kind of mental block where the gymnast completely loses any awareness through the air. This makes it incredibly hard to perfect her movements, which would later lead to many accidents happening to some of the best athletes on the planet. Biles often referenced the legendary Naomi Osaka as her role model and also the person from whom she had learned about how to deal with such issues. Bowers stepped away from the sport for more than a year, focusing on some of the most important issues she had been dealing with. In fact, many didn't even know if the young American superstar would ever compete again. 
She had already won numerous Olympic medals, and this was more than many people would ever accomplish in their lives. However, the temptation of the 2024 Summer Olympics held in Paris, France, was certainly something that Biles simply couldn't pass up. Now, being a bit older and having more experience in dealing with the frustration of mental issues accompanied by the world of gymnastics, Biles seems to be readying herself to break a few records. The comeback for Simone Biles started in late June of 2023, where she ultimately returned to competition in the 2023 US Classics. Whilst many athletes often take a couple of competitions just to get back up to speed, Biles wanted to make a statement. Upon returning to competition, she competed in her four main disciplines, this being the all-around balance beam, floor exercise, and vault. She would run through the competition and win all four of these events, which also secured her the necessary qualification score she needed to compete at the 2023 US National Championships. Being such a great performer at the National Championships, no one truly doubted who would walk away as the winner. In the all-around event, Biles secured her eighth national championship, also winning the balance beam and floor exercises. She would finish with a bronze medal on the uneven bar, a discipline she has been rather unpredictable in. During this world championship, she also broke a few new records, becoming the oldest woman to win the title at 26 years and 166 days. This would obliterate the record held by Linda Metheny Mulvihill, who held it since 1971 at the age of 24 years and 100 days. Once again, this would prove that Biles was just on a different level, and her competition awareness was incredible. Biles would go on to compete in the World Championships, helping Team USA to a record-breaking seventh consecutive team gold medal, which definitely proved that she was one of the most pivotal stars in gymnastics and the focus would automatically shift from here to the 2024 Olympics in Paris. While she is now somewhat older and her closest competition is around three or even five years younger than Biles, the young star had to make an impression in the first qualification rounds for the Paris Olympics. In fact, many would expect her to qualify, but no one expected what she did to secure this. You see, the Gymnastics US Olympic Team Trials is a prestigious event in the Olympic community, and it is often one of the breeding grounds for great talent. But Biles also understood this would be a great opportunity to put herself back on the map. Biles would light up the scoring charts on night one of the competitions. Her incredible floor routine received a 14.850 score, which was head and shoulders above her competition. Overall, she had a score of 58.900, which was nearly three points higher than her closest competition, Jordan Childs, with a score of 56.400. Biles didn't only focus on this incredible floor routine, but fans blew it up all over the internet. And this can be largely attributed to the selection of music for the routine. In fact, Biles chose the instrumental version of Taylor Swift's Ready For It. Many also believe that Biles might have been part of these songs, which is why she had chosen them as a way of marketing and also ensuring an incredible reaction from fans. Well, this worked a treat and Biles was on track to make the Olympic squad. In fact, her stunning routine made it almost impossible to leave her out and Biles was certainly assured of a spot on the US national team. Now, with a couple of days left until the Paris Olympics officially kick off, Many have been wondering how Simone Biles might perform. To date, it seems like she is possibly on track for one of the greatest performances of all time. And regardless of her age, she should comfortably win at least one more medal. But what about making history and becoming the greatest Olympian of all time? Check out this next video to see if this is even possible.